Ladies and gentlemen, hello, Sharif here. Welcome to the channel, the channel that tells you others don't. What do I have today? Oh, someone, uh, something that we haven't heard from them, you know, for quite a long time, uh, actually. The Kangertech iBar. We haven't heard from uh, Kangertech for quite a while, uh, you know, um, for quite a few years, I would say. But this one is, uh, you know, it's fairly new, you know, from them. Uh, there it is, I got it in a wine red and it fades into some sort of a navy or black, depending on which way you see it, but it's it's more of a navy, a very dark navy. It's a square one, as you can see there. You've got your uh, micro USB at the bottom there. It's smooth on two sides, the button side, and uh, you've got a few ridges, uh, you know, there, you know, as you can see. And um, you got your airflow is in which is in here, and you can do something with it if it's too airy for you. It's a manual only, so um, uh, you know there's no auto power in there. It, it has two powers, so you can use it, you know, both, uh, you know, both ways. It's an 800 uh, milliamp power, 800 mile worth of a battery. It comes with one pod, only one pod, that, you know, that it comes with. So uh, be mindful of that. The pod is uh, 1.2 ohm. And um, you know, it's, uh, the ratio is quite good, uh, you know, you know, with the output. Uh, so uh, and the two power modes that it has. Uh, so one is the constant one, so it will give you three volts uh, constant, you know, all the way, you know, as the battery, uh, you know, goes uh, goes down. You won't feel anything. It will just carry on at the three volts until the battery finishes. The other mode, which is the bypass, so what, what what you call a bypass, is uh, then uh, it gives you the most of the power, you know, when the battery is fully charged, and then when it goes down, um, you will notice a bit of um, you know a lesser power, you know, in the throat hit and the amount of vapor that comes out. But that's usually is towards the end. So it, it you know it works quite well. The bypass will give you a stronger throat hit and a bit more vapor, you know, initially when the battery is full. Uh, but when it goes down to the, around about 50%, it will start, you know, very, very um, uh, slowly, you know, to see, you know, the, a bit of difference. So whether you see it or don't, you know, sometimes if you really concentrate, you might, uh, you will be able to feel it. It's a it's a nice little vape. I mean, as a comparison, let, let's uh, do a comparison, you know, size-wise. Um, that's the um, that's the eye bar there. That's the uh, Caliburn. Um, the, the caliber is a bit, you know, fractionally wider, but um, is a lot slimmer. Uh, you can see, you know, it's, it's a hell of a lot slimmer. And um, then we've got the um, the cross, uh, the Vaporesso cross, which is a lot wider. Um, uh, these two are very are the same uh, power output, you know, battery wise. They're both 800, um, 800 mile worth of a battery, and it's uh, fractionally taller the cross. But that's uh, you know as a size comparison. This one is uh, more of a rectangular shape, and it's slim on this side. This one is all square. Uh, that's the box it comes in. Incidentally, uh, there it is, and it's, uh, it shows the color you know that you bought. Uh, you know, as uh, I bought this wine red. And um, you got the what? What do you what do you get with it? You know, there it's a fairly simple one, really. Uh, the only a, a bit of a downside it comes only with one pod. So if the pod doesn't work for some reason, uh, which happens from time to time, uh, so I'd advise if you want to get one of them, get uh, get yourself a spare um, pack of pods. You know, just in case. Or um, you know, it's, it's nice to have a spare if you're going to use that one on a you know on a longer term basis. Um, the uh, the battery indicator got three lights there, uh, you know, as you see there. So three lights, these will go down, you know, down to 60% and then uh, the last 30% will be the, you know, one light only. And then you get the um, bottom uh, light there, which is red now, and that would be the um, bypass. So the red, um, you know, when you press the button, it will be the bypass mode. And then you press three times, one, two, three. And it will switch, you know, to a, to a green one, which is the um, the constant three volts one. Also, it does vibrate. So, you know, there is, uh, I, I like that there's a feature in there, which I'm going to tell you about, you know, in a, in a few seconds. When you take the pod out um, and you put it back in, it will vibrate, acknowledging the pod. And there is a blue light that will come out uh, very briefly. The pod itself, you know, is a two mil capacity pod, uh, one point two ohm, which is uh, quite uh, quite reasonable, um, you know, for the size. 
and uh, you know that's uh, that, that's what it is the filling is quite easy on it and it's got a nice uh, nice hole in there as well and there is a bit of a lip in there if you manage to catch it uh, sometimes i do sometimes i don't there it is there um you know and it, it comes out so you can actually once once you get it you get a hold of it you open the uh, filling hole which is there you can see it's quite a quite nice filling hole and you can swivel that uh, rubber uh, uh, stopper or uh, you know where you f the filling port you can swivel it and then you can have an open hole that you can uh, fill and then you put it back and I, I haven't had problems uh, you know filling it you know sometimes you get some uh, pods that you do um, you, when you put the liquid in it uh, <laughs> floods back but this one doesn't do that it, it goes only one way because there's a couple of uh, couple of uh, dips there or ridges um, here they are uh, those ones there so can only go one way and once you put it in you get a vibration uh, you know in there assuming they got the vibration I, th I think what they've done is uh, is a very uh, is a very good thing so if you take 15 puffs say which is the equivalent because the equivalent of a cigarette is about 13 to 15 puffs and anything in between there when you take 15 consecutive uh, puffs within a quarter of an hour within 15 minutes it will vibrate it will vibrate twice you know to tell you you know um, either watch it or you've done um, you know a whole cigarette so it's very good for people that are switching so they can measure what um, you know how many cigarettes they've had um, I, I think it's a very good idea especially for somebody that is switching so you know you know the uh, cigarette yeah it will take about 10 minutes to finish a cigarette 10 you know at the most uh, it's a pass through so you can charge it while you're uh, while you're vaping you sat in you know in an office or in your um, in your house flat uh, now what do i think of it um, i think it's a it's, it's a very good uh, piece of kit for someone that is switching throw is a very good hit a uh, very good throat hit um obviously the 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 throat hit will be more if you use it on the uh, on the bypass because in the initially you know when the battery is fresh you know when it's uh, fully charged it will give you a, you know very good hit and also equally the amount of vapor so we got it on the um uh, now at the moment we've got it on the constant um, constant one which is the green so uh, let's try it so there we are and then we're going to switch it to the um, to the bypass uh, the bypass mode, which is going to give you a red now. You do get a bit of a warmer vape, you know that one, especially but especially when the battery is um, new, and also if it's. Um, you know uh, up to uh, down to uh, two uh, two lights so when you lose the two lights i mean there's three in there um, you know at the moment so when you lose the two when you come to the last one you probably notice a bit of a difference the airflow uh, there is there's a bit, <laughs> bit of a diy airflow in here uh, you know if you if you wish so i mean the, the airflow it's not too airy it's not far too airy it's um, i would say it's just about right Yeah, it's, it's just, just about right for that one. But if you want, the, these are your airflows there, and they're quite, um, you know, quite, quite easy, you know, to, uh, you know, to see. There, there's one there, and one, there's one on the other side. It's on the uh, the part that is a bit um, that's got ridges in there. It's just a bit of a design there. But uh, and you will notice a hell of a difference if you want a tighter draw. You know, if you, you block one of them, it's a bit difficult because it's a manual one. But the best thing to do is just put, you know block it with a piece of cellar tape, and that will turn it into a really really tight draw. Eight hundred hours of battery will last. You know, a day or you know usually, or towards the um, at the end of the day. Uh, price wise, um, they're um, in the UK. They're hovering around the twenty pound mark. There's a lot of these. Um, that size uh, more they hover around that price so the uh, so it's a matter of preference really what do you like what do you want um, looks wise as well um, aesthetics uh, but I find that, that one is quite good actually the um, the drip tip you cannot change it's a pod uh, so you know and it's fixed uh, drip tip so you cannot change that one flavor wise uh, it depicts the flavor very well I mean Kanker Tech have been going on for a very very long time so um, you know they know how to do things so this is geared really for someone that is switching and there is a lot of people that are switching from uh, cigarettes to uh, uh, to vaping so there's there's quite a big big chunk of people that are doing the, that at the moment 
uh, and they have been for you know some time uh, the mod will uh, switch itself off after half an hour so if if it's been um, you know laying on a desk or uh, you know on a table or something or in a pocket whatever for over half an hour it will switch itself off it can be a bit annoying sometimes but it's a very safe thing so um, uh, I, I would commend them for that I mean it's a good one yes it is as I said you'll be annoying but um, there you are after after half an hour you come and press the button nothing happens so you need to press it five times and it will come back to life and it will work you know as normal would I recommend it I would recommend it because it's um, it, you know it's a functional uh, a very functional one uh, th there's no problems. There's no leaking, you know, in the pod. Uh, there's no liquid that comes into the mouth. Um, sometimes the uh, it will get muted a bit, like that maybe now, uh, and then just quick blow there or a tissue, and you know, a couple of times, and you know, it uh, comes back to life. There you go, and, and it works, you know, quite fine. It doesn't make any difference to the vaping experience. It's just the sound if you want to crackle. <laughs> then you do that. Yeah, it's, it's a very capable uh, piece of kit, very nice. Um, uh, yeah, I would recommend it, as I said, for people that are switching. So if I missed anything, please leave them in the comment, uh, comments down there and I'll answer you as soon as I can. And thank you so much for watching and your subscriptions are highly appreciated. Okay, I'm, I know I put it on the end there and I asked for it. But um, uh, yeah, it's always highly appreciated and uh, your comments as well. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you again in another video. Thank you. Bye-bye.